In this video, we're going to talk about how to change words to the uppercase, the lowercase, and also using the proper function as well. So let's zoom in. In the second column, I'm going to write the full name of individuals. So let's expand the width of that column. And then in column C, I'm going to use the uppercase function. And then for column D, the lowercase function. And then column E, the proper function. So let's expand the width of those columns as well. And so let's say we have names such as John Williams. And let's say Karen Wilson. As you can see, it, it's not capitalized properly. Now let's write some uh, more names. Let's say Kevin Garcia. Let's say James Anderson. And let's say Lisa. Gomez. So we have five names on the left and it's not properly formatted. So let's use the uppercase function. Type in equal and then upper. So this will convert, as you can see, it converts a text string to all uppercase letters. Now let's highlight what we have here. And thus, as you can see, all the letters has been uh, capitalized. And then we could extend uh, this. So now this entire column of information has been uh, put into caps. Now, let's use the lowercase function. So type in equal, lower. So this is going to convert all the letters to lowercase. And let's set, I mean, let's select rather, cell B3. And so we have John Williams in lowercase and then extend the pattern. And so that's a simple way in which you can convert a text string to a lowercase. Now, let's see how we could use the proper function. So if you type in equal, proper, and then select the text. So notice that the first letter of each word has been capitalized. And so that's the result of the proper function. And that's it. That's all there is to it. So now you know how to use the upper function, the lower function, and the proper function when uh, formatting certain words. Now, if you want to find more videos on Excel that I've created, feel free to check out the description section of this video. I'm going to post some links. And you could find... Uh, my Excel playlist, which I'm going to have basically all my videos on Excel in that playlist. So if you uh, want to check that out, feel free. You could also check out my channel. I do have videos on other topics, not just Excel. For instance, if you're studying for, let's say, algebra, if you want to brush up on your algebra skills, I do have a playlist on that topic as well. I also have uh, other topics such as geometry, trigonometry, pre-cal, and calculus in case if you're taking those courses. And for those of you who may be taking science like chemistry or physics, I do have a playlist on that as well. So feel free to check out my channel. And if you like the content that you're seeing, feel free to subscribe as well. Or you can comment to this video. I do appreciate all of that. And that's about it. That's all I got for today. That's my two cents. So feel free to check all of that stuff that I just mentioned if you, uh, or whenever you get a chance. And so that's it for this video. Thanks for watching.